Yes. And you want to know who we are? Please, tell we us. We are Mentor Me Memorable Moments, yes. celebrating a, a few months on the air with WLVS Radio. And you're probably tuned in to either MentorMe411.com or www.ListenVisionLive.com. You oh, can connect with us either way. Very good. Whew, we are here. Are you Tracy Evans? <laughs> Masquerade. <laughs> Lost well, we want to say hello to all 50 states. You go ahead now. <laughs> <laughs> all 50 states that are tuned in and yes. 135 nations, and I bet they're growing too. I hope so. Yes, yes. So welcome to Mentor Me Memorable Moments. Tonight we're going to have really a quadruplet type of program. Okay. Although it's a scheduled program for physical health, we also have mental health here as well. So Dr. Butler is joining um, uh, Jamila Nayroy to the program and we've got social health which is you William Craig the third and financial health which is me Tracy Everett Duncan and then this is spiritually based so you're not going to miss any of the tenants in health tonight that means God is with us yes always always with us and as we close out this year we want to talk about stress and, and I think the last thing I posted is that you know stress will make you slap somebody silly uh -oh. something like that if you okay. don't get a hold of it all right <laughs> and so we want to help you get a hold of this stress yes. um i say without further ado let's introduce the other tenants rock and roll dr michelle welcome dr michelle Butler jamila Israel. welcome <laughs> Hi. Hi. all in a masquerade yeah, yeah. happy now, new year <laughs> Now, are we going to do this program all in a masquerade? I don't think so. This okay. Is it is. Yeah. No, we're going to, uh, let's, you know what? Let's reveal. Let's take it off. Okay. All right. It's a new year. It's a new Hello. day. I don't know how y'all can live behind those masks 24-7. <laughs> <laughs> mm, mm, mm. so I think Tracy got me. That is really okay, good. I, I did a really secure knot for you, huh? Okay. Just rip it apart. Tracy, did you hear what William said? What? He's always saying something. He said, I don't know how y'all can be behind these masks. How <laughs> you can live behind these live masks 24-7. Oh. Okay, 
Hey, well, you know what? That sounds like another program. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well, we're definitely going to be dealing with a lot of things in 2015. We're going to talk about some of that, too. You know what? I do need that. <laughs> some of us are in our moment. Oh, wait a minute. And I think you're going to do a segment on that, too, as yeah. well. Oh, my gosh. We need to talk about this. Yes, a little faster, yeah. a little harder. That's it. I can feel it now. Okay. In the winter time. Stress. Yes, yes, yes. So we are going to talk about stress, you know, and, mm-hmm. and I know a lot of the giggles, a lot of the laughs is because the year is almost over. Yes. We've had some failures. We've had some accomplishments. Yes, you know, we have. But we're always pressing for the future. We're always looking yes. for that breakthrough. And so I think that is what we're going to be helping you with tonight as we deal with stress because it does affect the physical health. Sure. It does affect the mental health. Absolutely. And I'm telling you, if you're going to miss some time at work, it's going to affect your financial health yes. and then you're yes. not going to be health. hanging around with people. Yes. That's mm-hmm. right. Your social health. And then pretty soon you're depressed and it's going to affect your spiritual health. Absolutely. And we don't want that to happen. Mm-hmm. We don't want you to also jump across the table and try and choke somebody <laughs> on a conference call either. Do not you know? do that. Yeah. So yeah. without further ado, Mike, if you can load those... Um, slides for me. We're going to talk about this segment, which is Miss um, Neroy's segment on Calgon. Take, Take this stress, stress away. away. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so the next slide, please. So when we're looking at stress, and I'm pretty sure we all have an idea of what stress is, yes. okay? Uh, it is your body's way of responding or reacting to something good or bad um, mm-hmm. or whether that's an experience or whether that's a demand on your body. Yes. Um, it can cause the body to react by releasing chemicals into the bloodstream. This is interesting, and I'd like to hear Dr. and Michelle talk a little bit more about that, too. Yes. Mm-hmm. And then stress can be could be considered a good thing, um, and that's uh, – if you are in physical danger or you see someone in physical danger, all of a sudden you get that mm-hmm. adrenaline mm-hmm. and you are able then to lift a car off of a child. Fight or flight. Yes, yeah, yes, that's yes. That's a yes. good stress. Mm-hmm. That's a good stress. Mm-hmm. But then a bad stress would be anything that's in response to an emotional experience such as the death of a close friend mm-hmm. um, or constant worrying. Mm-hmm. And that death of a close friend can be, you know, pet. I have suffered uh, pet death. I mean, I've had pets before, but this one pet, mm-hmm. I loved him yeah. so much. And when he died, you know, it just kind of crushed me. Yeah, he's a dog, but still, he's a he member was of your my family. dog. Mm-hmm. He is. And there are a lot of pet lovers out there that feel that yeah. too, mm-hmm. and they don't know how to press through that kind of stress. Yeah. Or channel that emotion. Yes. Yeah, well, mm-hmm. say a little bit more because I want to know about these chemicals that are being released in the bloodstream. Yeah, that's stress is something that's really un I want to say undefiable, but it's not because we suffer with all kinds of stress. And the fluids that run through our veins in regards to the stress, it's our lymphatic system. It is also our immune system is what's being attacked because our immune system fights off that is the fortress, the fort. Uh, for our bodies to they stand on God you know and when these invaders come whether it be people whether it be events or people places and things that stress us out the immune system you know they it stands guard for us you know to help us to fight off those stressors right mm-hmm. so I mean the fluid that runs <laughs> the the blood if you will boils hot oh yes yes yeah let's just keep it in simple layman terms it boils hot Mm -hmm. you know and all the things that the blood is consist of yeah sends out messages to the brain to the body because Mm -hmm. the brain is the controlling system sends out messages to the to the brain and to the body and you know the blood gets hot Mm -hmm. you know and so we get stressed out but now remember stress comes in a lot of different forms and a lot of different levels Mm -hmm. you know and uh, we have to be very careful in letting stress or these stressors to stress us out i think we want to talk about those different types of Mm -hmm. stress too so we can look at the next slide please 
when we're say, uh, asking just how bad is it, millions of Americans suffer from stress each year, and mm -hmm. over half of them say that they have high levels of stress at least twice a month. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me, and I thought this was interesting because I can't tell you how many times I am stressed a month. And I'm sure All of us. <laughs> It's more than month long. <laughs> more than oh, absolutely. Shoot. A day. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, a day. An hour yeah. sometimes if you got a deadline. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yes. And that yeah. stress can um, contribute to heart disease, high blood pressure, and strokes and make you more likely to catch less serious illnesses like colds and mm -hmm. flu. Exactly. That's that that's that whole So what, what you fort. just said, Dr. Mm -hmm. Michelle, I was thinking of the uh, autoimmune deficiency exactly. you know, syndrome. So mm -hmm. the bottom line is your body is no longer able to fight off exactly as it's supposed to it's because weakened. things are going out of control. Mm -hmm. Things are going out of control. That's right. Okay. And those those mm -hmm. little soldiers that come in and fight, they can't mm -hmm. fight back because those stressors, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. is Locking. giving the body. They right. start attacking Locking. you. Yeah, right. they start attacking you. Absolutely. <laughs> Friendly fire. Yeah. And it also says mm -hmm. that um, it can also contribute to alcoholism, mm -hmm. obesity, drug addiction, cigarette use, depression, and other harmful behaviors. Right. Mm -hmm. So that, and I think we even mentioned it in That's one genetics. of our programs. Well, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh -oh. That's <laughs> genetics coming out there. <laughs> right. That is true. Mm -hmm. But I think we mentioned in one of our programs that by the year 2020, that most of the prescriptions that are going to be written will be for mental health because of yeah, the emotional absolutely. stressors, yeah. things like that, That's and physical health. <laughs> so let's take a look at the next slide. So how does stress affect us truly? And I think yeah, each and one of good. the tenants can, can speak to something that's mm -hmm. in this little chart right I'm here. I'm stressed. Pardon me? <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> Louder? <st> <laughs> I, I, it's funny how that diagram is... Um, it's designed that way. Mm -hmm. you, know? you got stress in the middle and it's red. Right. Yes. Like the heart. And it's the, at the heart of the matter. It is yes. the heart of the matter. Yes. My yes, gosh. Yes. But isn't it interesting how when you are stressed, and sometimes we don't even know we're stressed, but we'll start to get sick. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's true. You yeah. feel so. symptoms. And like you said, you don't even realize. I know I've had right. that. Headaches. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And not understanding. Mm -hmm. You're just stressed. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Subconsciously, yes. you're being bothered by this thing. Oh, and symptomatic. Now it's, yeah, mm -hmm. it, it's mm -hmm. showing itself. Yeah. Through That's true. And, and that mm -hmm. goes back to the segment that we did on perception reframing. Exactly. That headaches, you, there is no nerve up mm -hmm. there. So how do you have a headache? Right. Right. So it has it's to a be symptom. something, something else yes, going on. in the system. Mm -hmm. That's a symptom. Wow. So mm -hmm. let's take a look at the next slide. What are the causes of stress? So there are at least four different causes that I have found. And, and I think, Jamila, you have offered up some information in this, too. So you may want to share on this. The survival stress, which is the fight or flight, is Absolutely. when you're afraid of something or that something physical is going to hurt you. And you have this burst of energy right. that either you're going to fight to the death mm -hmm. or at least mm -hmm. until you have uh, incapacitated the other person or you're going to run. Mm -hmm. yeah. and, and and I mean, sometimes that's not a bad thing either. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> Live to see another day. <laughs> yes. The next slide says that um, a cause of stress is internal stress. When you mm -hmm. worry, 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 and you're constantly worrying. And this happens when we worry about things that we have no control, control of mm -hmm. whatsoever. Yeah. And we don't know what to do about it, but that stress right there is causing some damage to the system worrying well. is the wearing is the worst type of stress there is mm, you know really? yes absolutely it is i mean alongside what eating well, <laughs> a <results>. nutrient yeah. <laughs> not eating well and some trauma or something like that mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. wearing raise up a whole lot of stuff up in you right. you know mm -hmm. and it it really messes with you physically and mentally mm -hmm. mentally mm -hmm. that's the last thing you want to do is worry about something why are you going to worry about something that you don't have any control about control over. Yeah. right and, because and if you if point. you worry about that thing that you don't have control about guess what that thing is going to control you mm -hmm. so stop wearing mm -hmm. yeah but i think yeah. that this that particular worry is where people need tips and they need right. help on how to not worry about something they can't fix because most of the time I'm assuming you're worrying you don't want to worry but you don't know how not to worry that's mm. right that's right yeah, yeah we're going to help them how to 
stop the We're, worry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Until it's, you it's find other ways. Really easy exactly. to say, don't worry, but how do you not worry? Yeah. 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 So let's take a look at the next slide. When we're looking at environmental stress, and this is stress where it's too noisy, mm -hmm. um, you can't stop to think because it's just too much going on. And it could actually be stress for someone who has a phobia of being in closed spaces mm -hmm. or maybe. Uh, spaces that aren't very hygienic or clean mm -hmm. like the metro in the washington toxic area yeah, yeah toxic yeah yeah, yeah. So environment you get on, is toxic you get in these crowds you get on these uh, trains or these buses and mm -hmm. oh my god <laughs> come on now yeah. <laughs> the air that you breathe no. when you walk on when you're walking out there with your shoes off mm -hmm. you know oh, no. when you're touching on railings you know hugging people That's can be right. toxic if you're not That's you right. know sanitizing washing mm -hmm. your hands because I don't want to promote sanitizing too much because you really should be using soap and water mm -hmm. as you're sanitizing right. but you know we live in a toxic environment we breathe the air you know mm -hmm. we the people that we talk to are very toxic right, right. you mm -hmm. know the response that they give us is very toxic mm -hmm. so that environmental toxic is everywhere mm -hmm. and then that, I read an article or heard someone in one of the documentaries that I, I taped where they were talking about by the time new money circulates through the system Right. It has 37 different types of diseases wow. and anthrax and drugs and all kinds of stuff on it. So, I mean, it's enough to cause stress. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yes. Yeah, because yes. they say it's the one thing that never gets washed. Yeah. 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 Wow. yeah that's so true. It travels all around the world. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That's and it's right. yeah. Baby. yeah it's start right yeah right right it's very toxic it starts off with the with the ink that or the chemical ink that's being laid on the paper first mm -hmm. and then it travels through the system just and like you say so yes. it starts yes. out toxic yeah. Whew. Next slide, please. Okay, you know, we haven't gotten you a little afraid or something by now. Oh my gosh! If you scared, send me all your money. <laughs> okay. 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 All right. All <laughs> no. So when we're looking wow. at the next slide, I mean, I think this is one that we can all relate to, where okay. stress. Um, can be caused by fatigue or being overworked. Yeah, um, it takes a toll on the body physically. Right. Definitely. Yes, it definitely does. It can cause it can be caused by working too much and too hard at your job, school, or home. It can also be caused by not knowing how to manage your time well and how to take time out for other things. Um, it's the hardest kind of stress to avoid because many people feel this is their out of control experience. Right. And sometimes just the cares of life. Yes. You absolutely. know, uh, and uh, I believe it's uh, Mark chapter 4 where uh, Jesus gives the parable of the sower mm -hmm. sowing seeds. And as he explains to his disciples the part about the thorns choking out the seeds mm -hmm. that had grown up, he talked about it being the cares of life. Mm -hmm. and, and so often the, just the bills that are due and mm -hmm. mama yeah. needs care and baby needs mm -hmm. care and yeah. daddy needs care and I don't have time to get cared for. That's right. And all of that weighs on an individual That's right. and can cause that same type of stress. Well, we're the down. sandwich generation. We're yeah. taking care mm -hmm. of children yes. and we're and taking parents. care of our of parents. The parents. Yes. Yeah. That is stressful. Yes. Yeah, yeah, it's highly stressful. Yes. 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 On that back burner daily. Daily. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. Say, well, we'll deal with us tomorrow. Right. I'll mm -hmm. go and yeah. do I can handle it. Tomorrow, but if tomorrow, we go down. Yeah. Then goes the family unit to right. a degree. And, and that's yeah. stressful. Yes. Just knowing that, <laughs> that is. all of that weight rests on my that's shoulder right. is stressful. That's right. And, and you may have siblings, too, that can do or take some of this stress off of you. And for whatever reason, they do not. And that's and stressful. That's stressful. And that's <laughs> relationships. <laughs> yeah. stress so well. So yeah. why should we take That's that? right. You don't look like you're hurting. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah, really. You're doing okay. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Call me when you need me. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Would you do hear them say if a mother and a child was on an airplane and the airplane was going down mm -hmm. who would you put the oxygen mask oh, on right and right. we as most self people first. would say our baby our baby mm -hmm. but they, no it's doubt. self first but who gets your baby out the plane that's right, right. if you if go you down put, you know so that's again right. that's, like that's something stressful. we need to talk about and think about daily we've mm -hmm. got to take care mm -hmm. of us well I know for sure you know I'm opening up my practice in 2015 right? I've talked about it here <laughs> I know who I'm called to. I'm right. called mm -hmm. to the angry black females yeah. or the angry females out there, women in general. And this is an area where women are very highly toxic yeah. and they mm -hmm. don't take care yeah, of themselves. You know, it's there is so much pressure. And I think about this often as I come across women 
who, in, in my opinion, are just jewels, genuine mm-hmm. jewels. And I look at the responsibilities, the loads that they're carrying by themselves. Mm-hmm. And, I, and, and I say, well, where, 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 I put it, I just put it out there. Where are the men? Okay. Where are the men? <laughs> Hello. And, Hello. And, and, Hello. And it got quiet. <laughs> knock, knock. No, it got quiet up in here. <laughs> <laughs> knock because, knock. Because we find ourselves being the candlestick makers, the movers, oh the goodness. shakers. I done been a police officer, an attorney, a doctor, all of that in one month. Okay. That's how she has Hormones are raging. That's right. <laughs> right. Realistically, right. as women, and not to discount because they're men, my, my that's nephew true. is doing it. That's he's true. Certainly. He's yes. 22, he's a father of two, and he's a single parent of one. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Amazing to watch, right. but but even in 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 the salon, I, I do run across a lot of women yeah. who, yeah. you know, they come in, they look a particular way, but when you crack that nut and you get to talking, yeah. right. some of the stories you hear yes. will break your heart. It's amazing. I'm, I'm, oh yeah, I'm sitting saying, I'm sure. And I'm sitting up here licking some wounds over my own issues. Mm-hmm. Right. Right. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yes. 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 My stuff yes. don't yes. seem but so what bad. It does, That's right. It yeah. prompts me to be a better service provider to these women sure. that when they come in. This mm-hmm. is their thrown away from mm-hmm. home. Yeah. I'm here mm-hmm. to take care of you. Right. Right. You know, because everybody wants to be taken care of. Mm-hmm. And, and we're yeah. not taking right. care of ourselves yeah. right. enough. Yeah. That's right. So let's take a look at the next slide. When it and says, don't forget mm-hmm. the hormonal stress. We talked about the, the physical stress, mm-hmm. hormones. Okay. Oh, yeah. yeah. Because yeah. I know hormones. you have a, yeah. a treatment for that. Mm-hmm. And, I, and you know what? I love what you do. So you know I'm coming. Yeah. It's just, I will be at Dr. Michelle's <laughs> tomorrow getting my sauna because I want the toxins out of my, I want all these, these stressors out. I want the weight of all of this off of me so I'll have more energy. So I will be there um, to get my uh, sauna. Treatment. Yes. Mm-hmm. And also my foot <clears> cleanse. <throat> yes. Yes. And then we're going to sit down and talk about the nutrients. Don't worry. That the body needs. <laughs> I'm, a I, look, look, I'm right behind the Tuesday morning. <laughs> I got already got. I'm in the book, so y'all clean up well, cause homeboy's coming through. That's okay, all right, okay, okay. Right. So we're gonna walk it and talk it. So okay. stress can affect both the body and the mind, and that's why yeah. we have this dual mm-hmm. segment here. Yes. And when we look at that, we see that in short term stress, we have the heart that beats real fast because yeah. something is happening right now, and mm-hmm. um, we are sweating more, we're right. feeling sick, or there are headaches and mm-hmm. fatigue, yes. like we mentioned. Mm-hmm. Um, there are those butterflies in the stomach yes. just before you men- uh, have a lecture somewhere. You know your mind mouth is dry and, and your muscles get tight. This is what mm-hmm. I experience, you know, out of stress. The muscles get tight. Yeah. And then when the issue is over, mm-hmm. the body is so sore. Mm-hmm. Oh. Yeah. And sometimes you can just yeah. collapse. Yeah, that is yeah. true. People, and I, I've, I guess I've been through it not as much, but I've seen where people just go in for a whole day. They just sleep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Because they were so stressed, the body yes. was so stressed that now that that stress is gone, it just says, no, "Okay, nothing." That's right. Yeah, huh. the, the That's heart's right. beating faster, but you're taking less breaths. I was going to say yeah. the remedy to yeah. that is yeah. breathing. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, that's Take breathing. Breath. You hold right. it. Was I not breathing? Right. That's right. right. No, you're not. That's right. Oh yeah, my gotta, gosh, you got to release. This is like that segment we did on the bully. Right. Right. Whether the bully's in the office or the bully's in this, the courtyard, you know, right. this mm. is what the body goes through right. when the bully right. is experiencing right. that particular wow. uh, environment. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh. Wow. So let's take a look at the next slide, please. Yeah, We're looking breathe. at the bad effects of mm. these short term stresses. It can interfere with your judgment. You're not making oh, course, good, sound yes, decisions. Exactly. Financially, if you're having some devastations there, this would cause you to make bad decisions. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. You don't, you're not happy anymore. Mm. Yeah. And um, you can't concentrate. You can't focus. You, you just feel bad constantly, which means that you're growing into depression. Mm. Um, uh, it can you can experience anxiousness and frustration and anger because you can't do anything about the situation or you don't know how to respond to the situation or you'll feel rejected and you'll begin to internalize those emotions which could cause you to hurt yourself or yeah. someone or else. So, right. Yeah, sit down, sit down, sit down, meditate for a minute. So is this what's happening in the communities today? <laughs> oh, mm-hmm. Come on, now. absolutely. Mm-hmm. You can pull up to any corner 
and and look in the crowd and see someone that exemplifies everything you That's just That's right. Yeah. No. And why you even get in the car? Just go to Facebook and social media. You'll oh. find it all there. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Find it all there. All yeah. the business. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Next slide, please. Yeah. So let's look at the long-term effects of stress on the mind and the body. Um, it changes your appetite. Mm -hmm. So either wow. you're eating too much okay. or you're not eating not enough. enough. Mm -hmm. yes. And then you got yes. all these symptoms. Yes. And then you have sleep patterns that oh, are, gosh, you, yes. you, you, you can't sleep mm -hmm. half the time. Or if you do sleep, something jerks you because your mind right. is constantly yes. going. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, it affects your sex, li your mm -hmm. sex life your libido, and yeah. your performance. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. um, and wow. you have feelings of constant fatigue and exhaustion. Mm -hmm. uh, you're twitching That's or hormones. grinding your teeth, yeah. grinding mm -hmm. your teeth. Mm -hmm. grinding your teeth nervous I, energy yeah mm -hmm. did i not say on this program i have a broken tooth yeah. I, a few months back i grind my teeth wow. at night mm -hmm. i do That's nervous energy mm -hmm. so then you also get the <clears throat> asthma attacks and the stomach problems and mm -hmm. the skin problems mm -hmm. i think asthma yeah. is one that flares up because yeah. of yeah. this kind of condition mm -hmm. too yeah, sure do. wow so let's take wow. a look at the next slide the long-term effects, um, bad habits, again, is that um, it can affect you mentally. Uh, you may find that you have difficulty thinking clearly, dealing with problems. You don't want to deal with problems anymore. Mm -hmm. um, you're constantly worrying. You have anxiety and panic attacks. You just feel over. Overwhelmed. And right. you're looking and searching for the answer. Mm -hmm. And here we say that we are premised on, on the Bible. We walk the Bible mm -hmm. out, you know, mm -hmm. and we're not perfect. You know, we're going to fail sometimes. But for the most part, we know that if we're looking for an answer, it's in the Bible. Right. Yeah. So we got to work right. that out. So this is what we're going to be talking about in 2015. Mm -hmm. Now helping you walk it out. We talked it. Right. Uh, mm -hmm. And there are so many other things we're going to talk about, too. But we're as we're talking, we're walking, walking. and we're going to show you how to do it. Nice. So let's take a look at the next slide. All right. OK, just one more thing on the bad effects. Um, you have dependency, again, on the alcoholism, the cigarettes, the, the things that can do some damage to your body. Um, mm -hmm. You start neglecting work and school mm -hmm. and your social environment. Yeah. You have fears. Isolation. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fears about just any kind of thing. Just, I mean, have you ever awaken from a night sweat, a night dream, a horror, a terror. We're going to talk about those two, exactly what they are. And all of a sudden, it was a dream that you were flying and you're afraid to fly now because you're afraid of falling. Mm -hmm. These are the kind of things that subconsciously uh, seep into your sleep patterns mm -hmm. at night and disrupt that so your body's not getting the rest that it needs. Right. Yeah. Mm. You can't yeah. function or focus when you get up to go to school or to work the next day. You feel irritable. Right. Yeah. So um, let's kind of shut down the first segment and we're going to take a quick little break so that we can adjust a little bit more because lord it's hot up in here uh, <laughs> <laughs> let's not get stressed out okay. so, <laughs> what you're looking at is one of the um <laughs> artists that we have been featuring for our first year outreach 24 7 is a go-go gospel group hey poo mm -hmm. hey, I, I we need a mask for great party yeah he has a relative a part of this group too yeah. and if you go to mentorme411.com you would open up your web page and hear this melody that yes. they are singing mm -hmm. through um, through him and mm -hmm. so uh, through us. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a little short break and play for you Outreach 24-7 so that you'll understand what we are focusing on for 2015. Ooh. All right.
see the rest of that video, you mm-hmm. can go to mentorme411.com and click over to uh, the media, media section. Yes, right. media. We have mm-hmm. all the videos there. And actually, we have a tab for Outreach 24-7, too. You don't even have to go to the, the media section. Just click on Outreach 24-7, and you're going to see a page that's been dedicated to them by us. Wow. And you can purchase all of their CDs. They also have CDs available on iTunes as well. Nice. So p- purchase it from their site or for iTunes. But you know what? what? Um, Trinillo mm-hmm. Waters, I believe. Right. Yes. That's correct. Yes. Trinillo Waters. We call him Pastor Tree. He is going to be on the program in 2015. He just produced a movie that's Ooh. coming out in theaters in 2015. Nice. And right. it's called Those We Don't Speak Of. Mm. And uh, you can catch mm. that uh, on YouTube. Nice. If you take a look at Outreach 24-7, you'll find Pastor Tree. I don't have that loaded on um, our website just yet. But you can see little snippets of that. And it's something that's very interesting. I think you're going to enjoy seeing that, too. Right. Wow. But we are back now yes Yes. and um (laughs) william and i are here to support Support physical and mental health so we're going to turn this segment over to you right now absolutely so the question is how do we control stress in our life okay we're coming Mm. back to that so uh next slide yes Yes. yeah how do we control it and i guess they're saying we want to acknowledge our fears and our feelings and our issues it's normal we feel sad and grief reach out, support, seek support, friends and family, or mm-hmm. volunteer your time. Mm-hmm. Um, this is kind of personal for me. Um, building a business mm-hmm. has been very stressful yes, yes. on top of taking care of two boys and trying to take care of myself. Mm-hmm. Yes. So I do understand that, um, and that's, you know, the interesting piece is acknowledge it. Acknowledge what you're feeling. Because it doesn't make you weak. It doesn't make you weak. Um, I'm learning how to ask questions and get help and some support Mm -hmm. and have people help me better understand some things I don't know. Mm -hmm. I'm good at what I do, but in the things that I don't know, I'm asking. And that is relieving some of that pent-up stress that I've been feeling. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A couple of little colds has been jumping on my back lately. I wanted to get to the bottom of that. Well, and that's what stress is. It's it's pent-up energy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, so... We can do um, things for ourselves personally, right. you know, and you, you, you've you done excellent in regards to asking questions because the more we talk about it, the Absolutely. more we release it out there into that's the true. atmosphere. Absolutely. So right. then that's, a, mm-hmm. but you know, we can sit down and take time with ourselves, right. by ourselves. Absolutely. And remember we talked about them, those breathing exercises, Absolutely. learn how to sit down and breathe. And you know, for us women, I mean, hey, take a nice long bath with Absolutely. some Epsom salt. Okay, Absolutely. here we go. You know, okay. let's go get, <laughs> have somebody to rub candles. our feet Absolutely. and yes. do the candles. Right. And you know, right. make sure, Take care of your body. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, you know, just just sit down. So when we're in there yeah. and pampering ourselves, Absolutely. what kind of scents should we have in the bathroom? When oh, we're honey, the la- you could do lavender, yeah. rose. Vanilla. Okay, yeah. so y'all can come to see me, and I can teach you all about the essential oils <laughs> that will keep you calm and de-stress you, so right. that you could be less stressful. Lavender. Yes. <laughs> yes. But now you pamper the, the feet also. What do you feet. put in there? Um. We're using a little bit of everything. We, we mix it up. It depends mm-hmm. on, you know, what the issue is. And generally, we are there to de-stress. Okay. So the vanilla works yes. very well. Yes. And the lemon balm. Okay. I think we've been using lemon that as well. Lemon balm is calming. Mm-hmm. Um, we offer tea. Mm-hmm. And even for myself, yeah. I love See, chamomile things tea. like that. Calming. I do that all the time. Yes. You yeah. sip some tea, you yeah. know, sit in your nice little quiet space. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Tell the boo-boos the bye-bye, tea. you yeah. know. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. but, but the one candle. thing that really works is the breathing. And I think that when I bring my clients in, you know, and everybody's got so much going on in their life, Mm -hmm. I understand this. So Mm -hmm. I don't need to know if I need to distress you. Mm -hmm. I already begin to set this room up distressing. I put on my homeopathic, uh, it's the water waves. So I select Mm -hmm. a wave or water water sound. We have our candles there. We have our aromatherapies going Mm -hmm. on. Mm -hmm. And the room is kind of still. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So you get an opportunity to listen to your heartbeat a little bit. And I think oh, that that's yeah. Serenity is the word. Yes. Serenity. Mm-hmm. It's really yes. important. Yes. For me, it's been finding great books. Mm-hmm. What I've been going through was personal. 
you know, mm-hmm. because for any of us trying to start businesses, we want it to succeed. Mm-hmm. And sometimes we're not watching the path, we're watching the prize. Right. So I had to wind myself back That's a little right. bit That's and good. make sure I was taking the proper steps. Mm-hmm. And then the prize, whenever it comes, will manifest. Well, but at sure. least, you know, I'm not stepping on people or creating arts. Mm-hmm. I'm just trying to build this business to, again, be that thrown away from home to take care of those women who don't know how or have forgotten to take care of themselves. Mm-hmm. So so those that's a good tip. And then we as healers, we can do things like, I mean, we can reflect those things out that are distressful. Right. You know, like wear bright clothes instead of dark clothes. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. You know, Absolutely. colors colors say a lot. Mm-hmm. You know, when I go into a home, the first thing I'm looking at is your walls. Right. You know, mm-hmm. and seeing, okay, what kind of mess, what true. kind of craziness is going up on right. the wall? That, yeah. Do you have a lot of, do you have a lot of activity going on? What, what color is the wall right. you know because pinks are very happy you know warm colors are very sobering mm-hmm. you know purples and lavenders are very calming mm-hmm. so reds right. I know somebody who have a red kitchen and it streams all the way into the living room and this one is so busy and I'm thinking wow no wonder you're so active right. red is very red causes you to um uh be very, very active, mm-hmm. you know. So if you got it in your kitchen and got it in your living room, when do you have sleep? You never you you stressful. Right. Yes. <laughs> That's the summons for the bull. That so, red. So that colors red. are very important. So yes. yeah, all of those things aid to us being distressful. So yes. let's look at the next slide. And the next yeah. slide. Mm-hmm. And that's uh, how to control the stress in our lives. Don't be in a rush. And I think being realistic is one of the first steps, Mm -hmm. you know, Mm -hmm. dealing with what is stressing you out if you can piece it together, if you can compartmentalize, because it can be Mm -hmm. so much at one time. I've got five million things going on in my head. If somebody could look inside, they'd start a TV show. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, Perfect planning. Yeah. Don't be in a rush, which is another hard thing to not be when you are stressed because it feels like everything has to get done. It has to get done now. Mm -hmm. Right. You know, so mm-hmm. realistically, I'm learning how to take baby steps. Mm-hmm. Um, going in and meeting my accountant, he brought tears to my eyes, and not too many people bring tears to my eyes. And he says, Jamila, the one thing I can tell by looking at you is that you've never taken a baby step a day in your life. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And he shocked me. I'm thinking, how do you know that? Because it's true. I'm always jumping for the big thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But this go around, I'm doing baby steps. All right. I do encounter some stress, but I can backpedal a little bit mm-hmm. put it in perspective and, and try all over mm-hmm. again so yeah okay. you know journaling is a really good idea yes. absolutely too. When we yes. talk about those baby steps at the in the um, beginning of the morning when you're having that me time with you and the lord just sit down and reflect on okay so what is it that i'm going to those steps that i'm going to do today mm-hmm. right and at the end of the day if you you do not accomplish all of those things at the end of the day. It is so okay. Mm-hmm. The thing, mm-hmm. uh, the thing here is that you have it on a piece of paper. You've journaled it, mm-hmm. you mm-hmm. know. And if it, if you didn't make it yesterday or try today, again. then you can try again tomorrow. Right. You know, mm-hmm. so journaling is very good. Yeah. But I like the the slide also. Uh, first, to your point, I had heard this minister say that if you have a problem that you are unable to solve, don't just jump right out of the bed in right. the morning. Mm-mm. Wake up. You know, mm-hmm. let the sounds around you mm-hmm. wake you up mm-hmm. and just stop for a moment. Mm-hmm. And then by the time your feet hit Before the bed, you put, I mean, yes. hit the, fo- the floor, you will have mm-hmm. the answer. Absolutely. Oh, I have tried that. Absolutely. I it works. Yes, but I it love works. that slide that said, you know, don't look at planning as being perfect because right. that's hogwash. Right. Yeah. Today, right. you know, that's too much stress Mm-mm. on a person. Right. You plan and plan, you plan to be perfect, and then when it doesn't happen, it's such a disappointment. It's too much right. pressure. Yeah. Exactly. Still shoot for the, the moon, right. for the stars, you know, <laughs> yeah. and, and right. be satisfied right. with what comes And to that true. point, mm-hmm. what I also read that wasn't there is that you have to celebrate the successes. Yes. Oh, yeah. yes. Because too yeah. much emphasis is put on yeah. what didn't happen, but doggone <laughs> it. Right. You had 18 right. things that Absolutely. did happen. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So, right. so let's yes. celebrate some of the yes. things that That's we, right. we were able to do. Right, because here's an affirmation. Yeah. Yeah. You go, Journal. girl. There you go. <laughs> as as yeah. Cat Williams would say, you know, <laughs> check out your star player. I know. star player. Yes. Yes. <laughs> and so next slide, please. Yeah. And this one is a powerful one, this slide here. Okay. Yeah. 
how to control yeah. the stress in your life and set aside the differences, lower your expectations, Ooh. forgive and, and release. Forgive and release. Say Ooh. that again. And that, you can tweet, that's you all can tweet, tweet that. that. Yes. Tweet yes. that. Forgive, forgive and, and release. release. We need wow. to tweet it. And, yes. and, and that forgive mm-hmm. piece is connected to so many things. Yes. Yeah. Forgive people, be it, you know, I'm, I'm having this talk with my son and he's saying, you know, but if we do da 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 and it doesn't work, then we failed. And I'm telling him, I am where I am today. Because of some of the things I failed in. That's right. I know some of the mistakes I'm not going to make this Can time. I, stick I a pen right it. there. Yes. I got to, because we learn, and I said this earlier today, mm-hmm. we learn more from our failures That's right. than we do from That's our right. Absolutely. That's Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. But it's mm-hmm. everybody's it's okay. biggest fear yes. yeah. to yes. fail. Yeah. But the reality is, as I'm yes. looking over my own life and I'm looking at this project, Yes, there are moments when I want it to happen quicker and I want things to come together, but what I'm not doing or what I'm avoiding are some of the mistakes that I made mm-hmm. that didn't end up successful. Right. Right. You know, and then you may have a, may have a failure that didn't work then, but it works now. Right. right. You know what I mean? So putting it in perspective. Right. Absolutely. Fail for Absolutely. <laughs> but the biggest and then but the biggest people out there, they fail and fail and mm-hmm. fail again. Right. And they are the most successful people. Mm-hmm. They are. <laughs> so, well, maybe that'll be a t-shirt you know, that I'm going to do because most people don't want to talk about their failures. Uh, they just want to talk about how great things are. Well, come around they, my office. I'll tell you about some of mine. Yeah, and let's do we a still, t-shirt. We're still going. You, you're not a winner if you didn't <laughs> fail. Let's do a t-shirt. I know. Right. If you don't fail, it means okay. you're not doing anything. Yes. Absolutely. Right. Absolutely. Right. Yeah. And, you know, and, and I, I like everyone to also look at failure as maybe it just wasn't the divine intervention it, time for right. you. Yeah. So you really didn't fail. Well, you didn't. You know, it's just not your time it's yet. Not your time. And right. believe me, when your time comes, nobody's oh, going to be able to That's stop That's right. You, you just oh keep chiseling away. And Absolutely. No, and nothing yeah. will be wasted. That's Absolutely. right. Yeah. That's right. That's That's nothing is wasted. Nothing, nothing is wasted. 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 Everything yeah. is gained. Yes. Take that little piece and put it in the envelope. Oh my. When I first started my business, God, he would just give me these little ideas and I used to just take them little ideas and put them in an the envelope and wait well, for them to manifest yes, later. Right. Yes, right. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> I was doing services for a, a doctor, um, head of psychology, and he said, Jamila, life is not a series of dots. Mm. Mm-hmm. Life, those dots complete a circle yes. which encompasses you. Yes. And when he said that to me, I said, you know, because we're doing something today, we don't quite know why we're doing right. that thing today. Right. But it somehow fits in that around. circle. Yes. It does. Yes. Powerful. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So it's not just random things. The things mm-hmm. that we're doing are all necessary to complete mm-hmm. that circle. That's so right. It's, it's well, positive. It says nothing That's right. is wasted. Nothing. Absolutely. Nothing is wasted. Next, Next slide. slide. Yeah. Yes. All right. This is one of my learnings. Uh, this is my t-shirt. <laughs> this is my t-shirt. I say lying at the this table. Is, this yeah, is my t-shirt. Listen, 2015. Oh, y'all, let me tell what you. What is that? Y'all listen, need some courage? No, no. Let me tell you. I don't have let a me problem tell you saying you, no. You, you talk about, there you talk about journaling. <laughs> and, and then I think we have to get there. We have to get there. Oh, right? okay. So we're talking about journaling. My phone right now, um, I can barely take pictures of my clients because it's so full. I could be at a stoplight and something comes into my head and I'm putting it in my phone. Mm-hmm. But the one thing I put in my phone a couple of weeks ago, and I'm counting down to 2015 because a, a phoenix is about to arrive. Oh, okay. Okay. You know uh, yes. I'm trying to tell y'all something. Yes. Right? Okay. Phoenix, she done been dropped in that fire. She's going to come back out yeah. beautiful. Okay. <laughs> but the one thing this phoenix did not ever know how to do, and when Ooh. I sat back and asked myself this question, how many times have you ever said no? Mm-hmm. 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 I mm. promise you, they could stick me in the ground and you call if 50 people show up. How many times did she tell you no? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. No mm-hmm. was the impossible in my world. Right. I had yes. to get it right. done. Uh-huh. Right. For anyone, for everyone. Mm-hmm. Mm. 2015, I'm going to practice it. Yes. Yeah. No. no. Okay. I'm going to no. practice it even when I can, right. but just to see if I'll right. be able to settle with no and then be able to go home and go to sleep. Or, that or not right now. No. It eats mm-hmm. me. Why did <laughs> you that person know? You could have right. gotten it done. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's powerful. How yes. to control stress in our life. Learn yeah. how to say no. no. I want to say, mm-hmm. hell no. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's what my grip, that's what I'm going to say. Because that stamps it right there. That means don't ask me again. Did y'all just tell that? Humble Jamela. I'm, I'm, I'm just, <laughs> no, because I'm, I, I'm <laughs> telling you for all that I've been in my life, I had to ask myself, Jamela, why don't you ever say no? It's not that I don't know how. Right. Mm-hmm. It's just that no means I can't, and I can't means... Th- you failed no. in something. Mm-hmm. Right. 
But guess what? Right. T-shirt. Mm-hmm. Hell no. Nah. No. Nah. Nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> but but nah. you know what? The bottom part of your slide, I think, <laughs> is real cute. important. And we can't miss that because it says if you don't say no, what happens? You become overwhelmed and resentful. And let me tell yes. you, yeah. that's crazy. Yeah. That is so where I am. I'm in the shop yesterday having what I thought was a pseudo neutral conversation, but I was busting off. I'm so tired. <laughs> people and I, the people looking at me like. <laughs> You know the people trying to throw a little joke out there because they want to mm-hmm. see. I was irritated. I'm tired of being irritated because mm-hmm. I just should have said no. no. Yes, mm-hmm. yes. Sing we've been moving forward. No. There you go. <laughs> no. Yes, honey. That's my new thing. I'm gonna oh, sing no yes. more. Sing no more. Yes. Out there, girl. no more. Overwhelm no more. No. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I'm enjoying this segment. Yes, honey. Oh. And then I'm going to say some, some yeses, good. but mostly it's going to be no. Just what you guys are thinking because I got to practice. Yes, That's, yes uh, you do. No. Yes, you do. Uh, yeah. And okay. shock your head when you say it. No. No. Long nose. <laughs> right. M- melodic nose. Hell no. Right. <laughs> I Next love you, slide, no. please. <laughs> I'm just saying. That's in the Bible. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, real not no. always together, but yeah, yeah. let your yes be yes oh, and let your no, no be no. Be no. no. I mean, and this you know, one right here, that's why I knew when she said we were talking about that, I just knew that this was all about me. Mm-hmm. How to yeah. control stress in our life. Stick to your budget. Mm-hmm. Don't fake it if you can't afford it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And right. see, that don't fake it if you can't afford it falls in with not being able to say no. Right. That's right. True. Yeah. Oh, wait, because I thought about this a minute ago. Because sometimes it's not saying no to others. It's saying no to yourself. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> That's true. So you know what? You're right. Yeah. I wasn't saying no to others. Yeah. I have been saying no to me. It's going to be yes to me. There you go. Yeah. 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 Yes, yes to me. That's yeah. right. That's yes, yes to me right. and no to but, you. But you know what? Yeah. Ultimately, you were saying no to you because there was some enjoyment. That you said no, mm-hmm. because you said yes, yes. to her, yeah. so you were saying no to yourself, yeah. as opposed to, and then that's why you became resentful. Yeah, but that's okay because I'm gonna work it out. New year, mm-hmm. yeah, New okay. year. New 2015 year. countdown. How many more no days? No, you, right? Yes, yes to me. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. two hours. Because every less. time, because every time you said no, and you had it in your mind right. that you knew yeah, you really, that you didn't really, yeah. but then you right. gave it, you mm-hmm. gave and yourself you gave up. It, yeah. So and the you next gave T-shirt, that time. Don't, be at, <laughs> don't hate me for saying yes. Listen, y'all, look for oh, a line, a look for a line of T-shirts. <laughs> a line of T-shirts. Yes, honey. Pamela, you I got a new business. You got a new business. You got Speak to yourself. You just you build a new business. <laughs> Every day. Okay. You're right. Mm-hmm. I Ooh. love this. Yes. That's good. Next, next slide. slide. Oh. <laughs> This is therapy for me. Y'all don't know. <laughs> all about Jamila. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, now. Here we go. How to okay. control stress in our life. Don't, don't abandon, abandon healthy, healthy habits. habits. Mm-hmm. Really? Get proper That's rest. Right. Mm-hmm. Indulge in moderation. Yeah. Yes. Right. And, and the thing so about it is that. So let's not get sick about it. You right. can indulge. Yes. But yeah. in, in moderation. moderation. Right. In right. all mm-hmm. things in moderation. Have yes. that pecan pie. Yeah. Okay. Okay. One slice. Oh, that's right. That's right. Today, months. and you can have another one. And tomorrow. then don't go in the corner and let me find you with the whole pack. <laughs> All right. Because Dr. Michelle is going to call you out on that one. Oh, yeah. Did you eat the whole pack? Yes. Today? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Today you ate the whole pack? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. That's good. Yeah. So, so, yeah, all things yeah. in moderation. Yeah. So, Cut the ice cream, sorry. Okay. <laughs> well, you know, ice cream. And, and as we're wrapping up, um, oh, I know that we joke and we kid oh, a yeah. lot. And, and and to relieve some of that stress, stress. Right. laughter, yes, laughter, laughter. Yeah. Oh, laughter. Yeah. hanging Smiling. around people yes. that you yes. enjoy being yes. around and yeah. having fun. Yeah. That's laughter. good. Yes. Yeah. It's healthy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes. That's why y'all got to hang out with us some more in 2015. Oh, yeah. 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 You do, you do. And there are also hugs. You talked about that earlier in the programs, too. What's that? Hugging. Oh, hugging. yeah, hugging. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Do you yeah, know how many people good. walk around and they are not touched by anyone? Yeah, when the point. women come in, I hug them all. And I didn't mm-hmm. even realize, for me, I'm giving it to you, but how good it yeah, feels. It feels. Yes. Yeah, it feels. Yeah. How empowering. It's, it's mm-hmm. empowering. It just, it's, it's a great empowering. start. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm going to hug. I'm just be hanging, yeah. hugging strangers. Can I hug? I love the hugs. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's, it's so therapeutic. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I do the helps ministry in my church, and I do the greeting. Hi, how are you? Oh, my <laughs> <God>. Okay, okay. <laughs> 
Mm-hmm. Perfect person. Yes, yes. Yeah. I know it but makes it some people so uncomfortable, but yeah. uh, yeah. when you're you're constantly hugged, it does release something inside. Yeah. But of you me. know what you do, like I do. You know, you you open up your arms, right? Mm-hmm. You, you you offer it right. to yes. them, and you watch them falling. Right. Oh, That's how absolutely. that happens. Test that. You just open up your arms. Yes. Test that. You know, out. and then watch oh. them fall into mm-hmm. it. People oh my God! Be it's a beautiful that, thing. They need that that yeah. touch. Mm-hmm. But oh. again, you know, these are some tips that we're giving you for yes. 2015 to yes. help you relieve the stress within you. I yes. bet you have some tips um, that you'd like to share, too. Yeah, share some with us. Yeah, how do you get yeah. rid of stress? Yeah. You know, yeah. a very good relief of stress. Mm-hmm. Okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. But then also, <laughs> yeah. you have... <laughs> Yeah. You have those times where you do exhibit some of these bad habits yeah. and you're trying to get rid of that stress and you, yeah. you're just not sure how, you know? Yeah. Dr. Michelle, you want to tell them about your practice, your um, perception reframing oh, tool and how to get in contact with yeah, you? Yeah, I'm sorry. I got a little lost because I was thinking <laughs> another way of getting releasing stress for the married woman. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay, well, okay. that yeah, leaves the single on ones out Be nice. Yeah. To your husband. Okay. okay. All right. Okay. And um, the two of y'all have y'all a little night out. Release mm-hmm. some stress right there. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's, yeah. okay. But that's for the married women. You single women, save it. Okay. 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 Now, okay. what was that question that you asked? No. I can't get in touch with you. After that. You still tell me you want to contact her. <laughs> still tell ourselves no. No, <laughs> no. But, we, but really, oh, we've God. got some segments coming up with Dr. Michelle that's going to address that's sexual make yes. Yes. Save it, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Believe me, after you hear this, okay. there will be no question about preserving your okay. virginity. And even if you haven't gotten that virginity anymore, how to preserve it. But in the future, yeah, well, 2015, we'll be talking about that then. Yeah, but you can come. reach Dr. Michelle because we're running out of time. Okay. How can they reach you? Well, you can m- reach me at um, www.mentorme.411.com, mm-hmm. right? Or, and you can reach me on my website at Natural Wellness Spa. Oh, I'm going with the spa. Natural okay. Wellness, I'm mm-hmm. sorry, uh, dot com. Mm-hmm. And or you, you can, do you mm-hmm. want me to give them the telephone number? Or we, no, no, they, they okay. can follow you there. Um, and and she's way. also on Twitter as well. Jamila, yeah. how can they reach you? They can reach me on 411. Can you? Mentor Me, Memorable Moments. Mm-hmm. Um, I can be reached um, through email uh, at salon, www.saloncocktails.com. Um, I can also be reached at um, on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hair Candy Bombshells, all capital, Candy, C-A-N-D-I-I. So these are the right. two um, tenants that you want to get your healthy... Uh, and it's going on in 2015. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're going to be back next week with William. Oh, that would be me. Yes, he's going to break <laughs> us in in 2015. And so between now and then, we want you to be safe, yes. be, be smart, smart yes. and, and be, be healthy. healthy. Bye. Happy Bye-bye. New Year. Happy New Year. <laughs> Absolutely. All right. Happy New Year. <laughs> be in good health. Yes. Yes. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. hey. Well, I wear my clothes like this big as I can And I wear my hair like this big as I can And I walk around like this big as I can And I do my thing like this cause it's who I am And if you ain't speak to me to give you an apology For being nothing that you used to and used to
that means I'm all When I dance, I dance to the beat of a drummer you don't hear And you can't see So if I look off beat to you, well, the problem must be you 